Let's watch some Final Fantasy VII, shall we? So, probably demo out. And I said it yesterday on the pod, but like, I am hitting the point where I think I'm seeing a bit too much. Okay. You know, I definitely uh, am somebody who I, I can I can eventually hit up a, a, a level of like, I'm seeing too much of this game before I get a chance to play it. The promotional material is I now. See. It's, not, it's overdoing it. It's like yeah. showing you too much of the too many movie trailers. I usually skip trailers for things that I want to see. Yeah. Because the movie trailer companies don't give a fuck what they show you. They just yeah. need to get you in the seat. Mm -hmm. So if they can get your ass in the seat, who cares if you see a spoiler? You know, Some movies that are really bad will just explain the entire movie in two minutes. You know? What happened to this place? It was Sephiroth. Who? He finished what he started. Oh, don't worry. He's been very, very, very active in part one. Oh, this quality. Yeah, the Smash Brothers character. <laughs> you know. Was he in uh, guys? <laughs> yes! I think that's what God I bless him, the ring. Yeah. What a waste of a good line. God, such a cool subtitle for a fuck, fucking nothing. Cloud, bring me the black materia. Right into it. Oh man, we're gonna be so tired of Sephiroth by the, the third disc. Of the end. The celebration of the faith. <sighs> A watershed moment for all mankind. Hey kids, sorry we're late. Hey! The most stylish fucking homicidal maniacs. Killing everybody. Looking good doing it. Dual techs? to be the first lucky lady. Hey boss, your guests are here. Cha! <laughs> At long last. Yeah, we're day, just going to see returns. everything here. They're showing everything. I refuse to be upstage. Oh! A second time. Rush is back. <laughs> Why? Why is he back? Fill your hollow heart with rage. Nope. I'm back now. I'm back. Well, that didn't we help. Ask that you retrieve it. The black materia. He to our oblivion. Please, it alone can liberate us from this endless dream. Passing through? You. Tifa! Whew! Hey, guys! They're getting some sun, too, huh? Yuri? Yeah. Well, Red? Huh. How do we look? Huh? <clears throat> you should get yourself a reading! It's got to be hiding some ginormous materia. Who's Sisney? I don't remember. Whoa. Hold this thing over right now. You said that Sephiroth is your foe. Crisis core. Mm. You wouldn't believe what he can do. Oh my god. There's so much extra. Playing FF7 is not enough. Oh, yeah, no, dude. AC, BC, CC, DC. All of them. An emissary from Wutai is here. Sent by Viceroy Saru. 
And then L-O. <laughs> because fuck you. And the naming convention. How could I ever hold my daughter again? Those we hate. Those we love. Those we fear. Genova would become anyone to fool her prey. Don't do this! But I'm no fool. Sephiroth! Hey! No. Not you. Here. Take it. This isn't about me, though. It's about saving the world. And you. The reunion. When spite and sorrow are harvested. To feed the planet. Well, some crisis core is is in yeah, fact happening. Final Fantasy Seven Divas director. And Deep Ground did happen. Gact is not real. Gact cannot hurt you. Gact is not real. Gact cannot hurt you. <laughs> Time ghosts. See, like, I know this is two discs and it's gonna be super long, but. Yeah, it's, just, it's too much. We're seeing too much at this point. We're seeing too much. God. I'm waiting, Cloud. Ooh. Ooh. In Final Fantasy VII Remake, Cloud and his companions triumph over destiny. Leaving the city I'm locked in. I, have, I mean, we started, so we, we've got to continue. But, like, I would actually, if we're, I were not streaming, like, just be like, okay, I'm good and stop. <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Yeah. Oh, they're going to show you a the bunch of stuff. The stage upon which this ragtag band story unfolds is both vast and varied. The world is made up of yeah. multiple regions. For special All events, content creation, react purposes. The grasslands. As opposed to just located due south of the real. This is where Cloud and the gang resume their adventure. Oh, check out the Junon region. Oh, you actually swim. Where a metropolis mm -hmm. by the same name overlooks the Oh, ocean, yeah. That's what that that's what that might. looks like. That's a strong chocobo. The Corel region. The resort town of Costa del Sol. Yeah, a segue. A segue. While the gold saucer stands as a gilded oasis above the dust bowl far to the south. Cactuar. Get win. The Gingaga region. Pay tribute to Zack by exploring his hometown. Or visit what remains of the local Mako reactor. God, this map is going to be insane. The Cosmo Canyon region. It looks very big. Become one with the planet as you return to Red 13's roots. I mean, just Midgar itself was like, you know. The Nebel region. The, yeah. If they did uh, giving this the same treatment. Lane with Cloud and Tifa. Or stop by Shinra Manor, where Vincent rests in peace. Your adventure will even extend to the high seas. Wow. All the different There's vehicles. more to do than simply walk around, however. Oh, it's that kid. First, Chadley. Let's look at World Intel. Assisting Chadley. 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 <laughs> yeah. His Such a weird world, new character. Allowing him to develop new materia. This research takes many forms, such as wrangling chocobos, or strangely with peculiar. the at their mog stools. You may also come across centuries brimming with knowledge. Oh, do we get to see like incest chocobos in HD now? Or layers inhabited by fierce <laughs> and unique foes. Chadley will also hey. enlist your help in researching mysterious artifacts known as proto relics. That's great. Each investigation is its own side story. You know those will be costumes you can equip later. Exciting new mini games and ferocious creatures. Are you up for the challenge? There's got to be a mode to just let and you once use you those in battle. All the proto relics scattered throughout the world. There's no telling what new developments might be in store. 
Imagine allowing the entire game to turn back into that mode. So a realistic environment, but all NPCs and main characters go and look like their old blocky PlayStation 1 form. With modern lighting. And team up with his pals to solve their troubles. Red stands on his high legs. In need, he will also strengthen points. Bombs I mean, he talks, so, you know. Yeah, <laughs> Each one of okay. these odd jobs boasts a unique side story. Some, like Johnny's questline, borrow aspects from the original FF7, while others no, highlight Johnny. content exclusive to Rebirth. You'll find all sorts of jobs the world over. A billion and little mini games. Yeah, look at all these mini games. Story yeah. Progression won't affect your side hustle. <laughs> wow. You can always go back to tie up loose ends, and this freedom. And I was just having fun with the darts. Story how you want is one of Rebirth's greatest strengths. Oh. While some fun. mini games are tied to world intel and odd jobs, uh, many are not. Left hook, right hook. For example, popular ones from the gold <laughs> Nice. Such as 3D with brawling. your fists. G bike and chocobo racing. What? That's sick. Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth 2. Doing Klim hazards and fucking Others limit breaks with just your fists is awesome. I like that. Are completely new to Rebirth. We've even fleshed out some of the mini games that were featured as part of the original Final Fantasy 7's main scenario. Though this one is not in the original, I highly suggest you check out yeah. Queen's Quest. <laughs> Speaking of hind legs! The story, it's <laughs> and what? Oh my god. Collecting all the cards Card game? Wow. Decks. Oh, what's the name? What's the name? Jesus Christ. The There's so but much of that. Okay. More minigames than an Assassin's Creed. By wow. And I'm the last. While mini games and map exploration are a big part of Rebirth's charm, there's more to it than just that. There are, there Rebirth is like a two, uh, a, a, a dog that even stands on its hind legs all the time because it has no front paws. Mm -hmm. So they can do that. Yeah, they can. It's just weird to see it on red. Midgar, up through to their arrival at the Forgotten Capital. We've taken painstaking hmm. care to depict how the group bonds during. What do you think the card game's called? One that ultimately decides. Tetra Triad. Fate. Oh my god! <laughs> Once you finish Rebirth, I'm sure. But is it deep? No other game makes you feel quite this yes. close to its characters. We'll, we'll tell you a third of the mechanics, <laughs> just to stretch the fun. The graphics. God damn it! Rebirth makes full use of the PlayStation 5 and its SSD. Meaning we could use much higher resolution assets than we could in Remake. And they will still load in the blink of an eye. Wow. I should probably... Hmm, I'm not going to get through Integrate by the time frame rate with performance mode. this comes around. But maybe just at least watch the Integrate content just to know what happens. Or prioritize 4K resolution with graphics mode. Whichever you prefer. Rebirth has you covered. Each character interacts with the world in their own way. It's Barrett very short. Objects. Mm. Okay. Yuffie swings across gaps. Tifa has her grappling gun. Red can climb along walls. Oh, and it's its own thing, right? It's not a part of the main campaign. You can just do it on its own. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah right. Not not ro not P5 Royale style. Okay, right, 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 right. True, 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 true. Whatever challenges you Thank face, God for the separation. your teammates will be ready okay. to help you overcome them. Now for the music. We wanted to pay respect to the original FF7's tracks, but also challenge ourselves by matching the feeling of each scene. Which resulted in some truly innovative arrangements. Why do they have to dub over the Japanese like, trailer? For example, the following. Why not just give them the original without any dub and it's your own company. What are you doing? How is that? 
If you enjoyed what you heard, we recorded well over 400 There it is. This game. Da, da, so there's plenty more where that came from. We sincerely hope you oh. enjoyed your trip with us. Cosmo, 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 all day. Story, but through gameplay as well. The choices you make throughout your adventure like will change the way your comrades feel when you take when you take aside the the, the big you know your safer sephiroths and your genovas and your big defining you know let the battles begin unstoppable etc cosmo canyon in fact even immediately weren't available in the original ff7 can now accompany you provided you play your cards right ah the saucer is packed with many incredible sights to see and things to Spend do. an hour watching Rizless Cloud. So your outing there will no doubt be a highlight of the game. Let's see the bro date. Already have someone who you'd like to go with? Cloud? Well, we hope they feel the same way too. Make it so you can go with anyone in the party. Expand that shit. You've had years. Sure. Companions will share a bond. Take Red on a date. He's yeah. A, he deserves it. With each other as well. Nanaki's a good boy. Your party level, a numerical expression of this bond, will increase as you overcome challenges. I'm going to accompany you. The higher this level, the more skills will become available in your character's folios. Confidence. A mechanic new to rebirth. Whoa. By unlocking okay. the skills etched in these tones, your characters will grow stronger and learn new synergy commands. Yeah, friendship. It's fe friendship sphere grid. Part of what makes rebirth's combat so fun is all the different character combinations. Switch up your team to fit the situation, or even your mood. Every possible party combination has its own unique synergy commands. So once you find Damn. characters that work for you, focus on tweaking your I skills love me a to double tech. your combat needs. I'm a huge sucker for double and triple techs, man. And don't be afraid to experiment. You can reset your folios at any time. With new characters and synergy commands at your disposal, Remake's satisfying hybrid of action combat and strategic planning has been made even more dynamic hmm. and engaging. We can't wait for you to experience all this and more. No in triples, Final though, Fantasy eh? Seven Rebirth on PlayStation Five. Wow, this was really active. いかがだったでしょうか。We promise she will die. Please look forward to it. この体験版では物語の重要なポイントとなるクラウドやソースを操作することができます。いや、we <笑> Please look forward to her excruciating death, Kudasai. <laughs> Producer Sam, there's a lot of people wondering about whether or not she will die. Can you confirm? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Watch it on. Watch it on. Zet tiny now. Absolutely. Oh, so, so, so. <laughs> oh, resistance. Yeah. Not a lot of games made use of it. The only ones that I really felt were notable were um, Returnal and Demon Souls. Which you, you got to experience that. It was pretty fucking cool. <laughs> Drain that battery. I Mine's plugged in. I'm not even playing that game anymore. With this pro controller. 
Damn. Chadley! So like, this song is, has already become a, a classic now, I guess. Nice with the right out of the gates. With the blue. Get that Kingdom Hearts 1 cloud reference going too with the with the wrapped uh, with the scarf and the wrapped Buster Sword design. It was really cool. It only existed for that and then they made a uh, Advent Children cloud after that. What was I saying? Scarf. Uh yeah yeah no the, that design. Oh no, I was just going to say yeah, Chadley, that kid that that dude you see there. It's like yeah, he's just like this weird kid that like makes materia for you and stuff. But he's just got like this weird kind of glasses thing and he's he's just kind of like odd for no real reason there's, there's he's, okay. he just he's just a little, just a little weird nerd kid you know um yeah anyway that's a lot of cool stuff um i i, I greatly look forward to the the gold saucer and the expanded date technology and all the ways in which cloud can be massively risless i want i don't want like the option to like be suave neutral or just fucking you know spill spaghetti I want three different kinds of spaghetti. I see. As promised, <laughs> the gruesome excruciating death from <laughs> from more angles than you've ever seen yes. possible. It's going to be brutal. Yes. Let's look at let's let, let's talk to some of our motion capture team over here who worked on the the, <laughs> the <stand. laughs> What were you thinking? Well, we wanted to really make sure that it felt like the impact was there, right. you know, gut-wrenching. So, so all the different ways yeah. you could fall impaled. You know, we weren't sure which one. So we took a blend of about five or six hundred different kinds of impaling death animations. And we created what we think is the most painful and excruciating one. Oh, yes. so, so mm, We spent a lot of time working on the haptic feedback. I see, see. When you work on the, the new game plus, you can control the sword you handler. The, and aim. you can aim the sword yourself <laughs> and feel the, the sinew and... Mesmerizing experience. Make no mistake. Truly. She will die. It will go down in history. <laughs> <laughs> For the first time ever, in fact, a countdown timer, if you would like to see it, is available in the accessibility options to the moment approximated based on your gameplay of when we think it's going to go down. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, I desperately need to know more about that card game. Mm -hmm. I need to know. Assassin's Creed 3, the less said the better, but it had a bunch of mini games in it, including uh, Dead Man's Morris, which was like a board game. Like, do you learn how to play on the pirate ship? And I was like, yo, I like that. Okay. That was fun. You know, and I'm a, I'm a, I'm a known Pazak enjoyer. I've, I've, I've been known to enjoy a mini game or two or a board game or card game or two inside of a thing. So... Uh, can I lose my entire mind and and hours going into this card game in its depth? This is the question I need to to know. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't I didn't want to see that much. The mini game stuff, definitely, that was really cool. The story stuff, I kind of it was too, it was more than I wanted to see, but I did it anyways. I did it for you. All right. Yeah, the things we do for y'all. You know what it is. Cue the white girl bit. 